Step 1. Secure vehicle to prevent it from starting off by itself. Wear closed and snug fitting work clothes. Do not touch hot or rotating parts. Step 2. Check steering play, shown here as A, at steering wheel. Turn steering wheel alternately to left and right until front wheels move. If the permissible steering play, shown here as A, at the steering wheel is exceeded, check steering gear and steering linkage for impermissible play, subject to separate repair order. Step 3, check boots, shown here as number 6, of tie rods, shown here as number 1, and drag links check the boots, shown here as number 6, carefully over there, shown here as number 2, of all steered axles, check the boots, shown here as number 6, carefully over the entire circumference and in the folds resulting from the installation position for damage. Check the firm seating of the boots, shown here as number 6, at the contact surface. If the boot, shown here as number 6, is damaged or leaking, replace relevant ball head complete tie rod, shown here as number 1, or drag link, shown here as number 2, subject to separate repair order. Step 4, check the tie rod ends and drag link ends of all steered axles individually for play, Hold each tie rod end and drag link end with the thumb and index finger whilst the steering wheel is moved alternately to the left and right. If there is noticeable play in the ball heads, replace relevant tie rod or drag link ends, subject to separate repair order. Step 5, check tie rods, shown here as number 1, drag links, shown here as number 2, steering arms, shown here as number 4, steering knuckle arms, shown here as number 5, pitman arms, shown here as number 3, and steering idler arms shown here as number 7, on all steered axles for damage and correct fastening, if damage or defects are found, rectify damage or fault, subject to separate repair order.